Hi everyone, and welcome to our Lumio Skills video. My name is Kaylee Gashion, and I'm a curriculum specialist. Today we're going to be discussing how you can use pre-made content and upload that right into Lumio. So let's get started. So again, our Lumio instructional skills video. So first up, what we want to note here is in terms of pre-created content, we can use notebook files, we can use PowerPoint, Adobe PDF, and other files that live in Google Drive, such as Google Slides. We can upload these right into Lumio to make use of our already made content and also use this to enhance learning opportunities for students without having to go back and redo work that we already have. You can choose from local storage, your library, or Google Drive. And what's also great is that you can add all of these into one existing presentation. So what I wanna do right now is head into our Lumio. So here I have it, I'm logged into Lumio, and this is our dashboard. Now we do see some lessons that I've already created down here, but what I wanna focus on is that green box with the plus sign where we can add in activities. Once I click on that, we're going to see that we have a few options, but what I wanna look at right now is that import resource up in the top left. This is where we can take a look at our PowerPoint, PDF, notebook, and Google Slides. And as you see, we have those different options to choose from your local storage, your library, or your Google Drive. So right now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my local storage, and I'm going to see what we have. So when we click into local storage, it will bring up all of my files that are on my computer. So I might go ahead and I might take a look at some of my different documents and see if there's anything that I want. I can also take a look into my downloads and I can see all of these different things as well. So right now I'm gonna actually look at one of my Lumio courses and I'm going to open that up. We see that when we do that, it's going to import the pages from this assignment so right now we'll see that that is coming up as a PDF. It might also be a Smart Learning Suite Online file, which of course is an option, but this one happened to be saved as a PDF. And once it uploads, it's going to bring it right into Lumio. So here we have all of our pages. I can choose if I wanted to select or deselect some pages. So maybe here I wanted to get rid of a few if I didn't feel like I needed all of these. And then I can go ahead and hit add. From there, we'll see that it will just take a second, but it's something that's coming from my Google Drive. Now, once it uploads, you're going to be able to add different content into this. So I might wanna go ahead down here and select the plus sign, and I can choose to either add some of these different templates or ready-made resources, or I might wanna actually go ahead in here and import another resource. So maybe I want to go this time into my Google Drive. And from here, I'm going to be able to see a few other options. So I can take a look and see if I have anything in my different categories. And maybe I'll scroll through and see if there's anything that works for me. I have some presentation materials. So let's see, let's do one of these PDFs. So maybe I wanna go ahead and select this sample presentation that I have. From there, we see that now we're building that content onto each page. So remember that you do have the option to do this for PowerPoint, notebook files, PDFs, and it's all going to live inside of here. So I can just close out of some of these and add it in. Maybe this is something that I wanna work with and turn into an interactive page. And we see that now I'm scrolling through and I've started to build out my different content. I can also play around and toggle some of these about where they want to be. And I can also click the three dot menu and I can go ahead and duplicate or delete pages. Once I'm done, I'll be able to finish editing and then I'm ready to go and push this out to my students. Again, I wanted to thank everyone so much for joining us today. Hopefully you learned a lot about uploading that pre-made content into Lumio. If you have any questions at all, be sure to hit that Ask Otis button and a member of our team will help you out. Have a great day.